here is something that you should know about the check engine light on your car if you don't know it already but I'm working on this 2007 Mitsubishi Outlander and it's got a check engine light on the story behind this car is that uh, the owner of the car called me to get the spark plugs replaced and I so I gave, gave him an estimate he likes he liked the estimate so he dropped off the car today and I drove it in the shop to get the spark plugs replaced but when I drove it in the shop I noticed that there's a the check engine light is on so and it's 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 uh, the car is shaking a little bit so there's a misfire I scanned the car with the scan tool and there's a P0306 code in the uh, on the skin tool, so meaning that there's a misfire in cylinder number six. Um, the point of the, this video is that um, if you scan your car with the scan tool, it's not a complete diagnosis. Especially, um, pe uh, most people think that uh, if you pu if you scan the car with a scan tool, it tells you exactly what the pr what the what the part is or what part needs to be replaced, and that's it, right? But no, especially with with a high end scan tool like this but it is not a complete diagnosis so that's the point of this video scanning the a car with a with a scan tool like this one or, or any scan scan tool is not a complete diagnosis it's just one tool that is used to get a to get a a, a diagnosis done or like to diagnose a problem like on this car right here p0306 um, and cylinder number number six misfire there are four major things that are uh, that make a a cylinder function properly. There's a spark plug, a coil, a, a a fuel injector, and compression. If you don't have those four things, the cylinder is not going to not going to function. So what's the problem in the cylinder number six? Is it spark plug? Is it a coil? Is it an injector? Or is it compression? So um, the scan tool just points you to the right direction. What, as to where to test, but it doesn't tell you exactly what the problem is, which is a problem with this car right here, but the owner wants to get the spark plugs replaced anyway. So uh, we're going to do that, but uh, it might fix it, it might not fix it. It's a 50-50. So because that's most of the time when you go to the to, to, a, to a part store, they scan the code for you, and the first thing they recommend is spark plugs for a misfire or a coil. So, but uh, it is not a complete diagnosis if you put a scan tool on a car that has a check engine light on. It's not a complete diagnosis. It's just one tool that, that's used to get the, the, the problem diagnosed. So that's something that you should know about your car uh, in case you, you get a check engine light on your car and you go to the parts store and they tell you that they, it needs spark plugs or coils or things like that. Um, it could end up to be cheaper just to replace the spark plugs and it fixes it or it can, can uh, add up if it's not the problem then you have to uh, replace the coils then you have replaced the, the the injector and things like that and you find out that it's it's bad compression in the engine which is like a major problem so but so I, I, the better thing to do is to get the car properly diagnosed not just put a scan tool on it and then that's uh, and then think that's a complete diagnosis it is not so that's something that I wanted to share with you you might know this or you might not know this but there it is and I hope you learned something from this video thanks bye